And hey, well, this is Francisco from Wondershare Mobile Trends, and a lot of us tend to operate on cross-platform devices, such as, let's say, me using a Windows PC and an iPhone as my daily drivers, for instance, of course. And if you fall into this category, then you must have struggled in the past to transfer any of your photos from your iPhone to your PC. However, that gets fixed today in this video. So we're going to be introducing you to three methods of transferring your photos from your iPhone to your PC very easily. Let's go ahead and dive right in. Now make sure to give us a like and also do not forget to leave any of your comments down below and also do make sure to share this video with anybody who could benefit from it. So do not forget to subscribe as that is going to be super important moving forward. And now as for method number one, iTunes is going to be a built-in software to the iPhone with the ability to play and organize your digital media collection on PC or sync it with any portable device. Now you can make use of this jukebox player on both Windows and Mac operating systems. So let's go ahead and discuss the steps on how to back up your iPhone pictures to your Windows PC. Now, let's go ahead and dive right into that first method. Organize the folders on your iPhone, of course, like for your photos. And then the first step when you have multiple folders of images is usually going to be that. So you need to combine all of the different subfolders into one larger folder just to be able to keep everything organized in one place. And then check your current version of iTunes. And you must go ahead and upgrade it to version 12.5.1 or later if you haven't already. And the third step is just going to be to connect your iPhone to your PC using a good USB cable, of course, and go ahead and enter the required passcode when asked. And tap on trust this computer and just allow the transfer of photos from your iPhone to your PC. And just go ahead and open up iTunes and then go ahead and click on iPhone and devices icon right on top. And then you can just go ahead and click on the photos panel from there. And then that section, you can just go ahead and click on sync photos and select your desired folders that you would like to just go ahead and drop down onto your PC in order to begin that transfer by just dropping it in. And it is going to be a very simple and straightforward method of going about it. This is going to be one of the many ways of backing up your photos from your iPhone onto your PC. However, we do have an even more straightforward method. To that is exactly when we move on to method number two. And the use of mobile trans software is going to be the simplest among the three methods that we're going to show you today. The software is an all around solution for iPhone transfers and backups and restorations even. It's a very secure and trusted to platform of course and you don't have to worry about losing any of your data when working with this program so let's just go ahead and discuss what steps are going to be involved in order for you to go ahead and back up your photos from your iphone to your pc using wondershare mobile trans so let's go ahead and dive right in with step number one and in this case of course it's going to be to go ahead and install mobile trans from the official website and connect your iphone to your pc after hitting the backup module right on the front screen and the window will appear after connecting connecting your iPhone to your PC. Here you need to go ahead and select the content that you want to back up, which in this case, it is going to be photos. And it's going to show you all of the supported content that you can just go ahead and transfer over in case you want to transfer over anything else that's not just photos. And once you're done, I just go ahead and click on the start button for selecting your desired content. And it's just going to immediately begin a backup, which you can just go ahead and further restore using the mobile trans restore module at any time that you would like. Hence, the software includes just about three steps on how to back up your pictures from your iPhone to your PC, but that's not it. Because we still have to go ahead and touch on our very last method, and that is going to be for method number three. You can also just go for Windows 10 Photos app to transfer all of the iPhone photos to your PC. So let's go ahead and discover the steps on this in order to back up your photos from your iPhone all the way over to your PC. So step one, as always, is just going to be to connect your iPhone onto your PC with the USB cable. And Go to the start menu, taskbar, or desktop in order to launch Photos app on your Windows PC. And select Import Present on the top right corner. All the photos are going to get selected by default, so it would just help if you went ahead and chose them not to import in this case. And then you can go ahead and select continue for further process. And then just remember not to unplug your iPhone during this process as it's going to disrupt the entire thing if you end up doing so. This is procedure uh, to back photos from your iPhone onto your Windows Photos app. That's going to be super important. And it might just be a bit of a pain to transfer your pictures this way. Of course, as you have to go ahead and select each picture that you're going to want to transfer over, unless you want to transfer over absolutely everything that's in your library. This is why we always recommend our 
reviewers had to go or recognize software for this purpose. And that's about it. Those have been three methods of transferring your photos from your iPhone to your PC. And now make sure to give us a like if you ended up liking this video and do make sure to leave any of your questions down below as we would very much appreciate those and we would love to be able to help you out as always. And do not forget to share this video with others if you found it helpful. But most importantly, do not forget to subscribe for more content just like this and turn on that notification bell so that you don't miss that content moving forward. And with that said, that's about it for now. And until next time, enjoy.